See what I mean? This is why we came to New York. You can't stage this kind of reality. <laughs> Excuse me. Looking for a Mr. Louis De Palma? That's me. Oh, hi, I'm Roger Chapman. I spoke to your boss, Mr. McKenzie. Right, right. How are you, sir? Listen, if there's anything I can do to make your visit here more pleasant or productive, just say the word. Okay. Boy, this place is thick with atmosphere. Yeah, well, sometimes the ventilation's bad. <laughs> Where do you want to start? Well, I'd like to say a few words to the drivers. I think it'd be good if I talked to them first. Uh-huh. See, I used to be a driver, and I have a special rapport with them. Okay. Okay, clowns! <laughs> Listen up here, and shut your mouths. This man has something to say to you. <laughs> Is that satisfactory? You bet. Thank you. <laughs> Gather in here. Hi. Hi. My Hi. name is Roger Chapman. Sure. Hi, yeah, we're my assistant, Leah. Yeah. And my aide, Richard. Hey, Richard. Now, sure. Hi, yeah, we're I just want to kind of let you people know where I'm coming from. We're going to make a movie about cab drivers. And the reason we're here is we want reality. Not Hollywood reality. We want real reality. So we want to... We wanna, live with you guys. We want to eat with you and talk with you and, and get inside your heads. You know, why don't you forget we're from Hollywood and forget we're even making a movie. We're just some people who, who would like to find out what it's like to drive a cab. Now, anybody have any questions? Okay, you. How'd they part the Red Sea in the Ten Commandments? Uh, he, he's only clowning around. What's wrong with you? Hey, listen, have you all had breakfast? No. Because no. I, I was just thinking of ordering something for all of us. What do you guys want? Oh. <laughs> no, come on. Hey, every morning we are here, I'm going to bring in whatever you guys ask for. So, what will it be? Well, uh, I'll have some coffee. Yeah, and some donuts. You can have anything, anything at all. Jelly donuts? <laughs> gotcha. Oh, hey, Michael! Michael! Oh, Michael, you're here, man. How you doing? I'm sorry, I'm listening. Nice right. It's all right, I just got here myself. Everybody, this is Michael Patrici. Hi. Hi. Hey, How Tony Banta. How you doing? Hey, hey uh, Bobby, you want to be an actor, too. Uh, Tony. Come on, you know you want to be an actor. Uh, Tony. Come on. Michael Patrici. Uh, uh, hi, can you give me a part in the picture? <laughs> I think we better get started right away. Uh, let me tell you what we have so far. We have a script, but it's not a particularly good one. It just doesn't have any um, guts. It's a story of a story of a cabbie named Joe. He's a good driver. He's been at it for some time, and and that's all we have. It's, the rest of it's going to have to come from you people. We want to hear all of your stories, and maybe one of your stories is Joe's story. Hey, you know, the guy you really ought to talk to is Alex Riga. He's got the best stories. OK, which one of you is Alex? Uh -huh. He's over there. OK, thank you. Alex? Hi, Roger Shatner. Hi, Alex Riga. Great. Listen, can we talk for a few moments? Uh, listen, I, uh... I mean, I don't know you. Uh, you're probably a very decent guy, but... Uh... <laughs> you're right. You don't know me. <laughs> <laughs> it's some kind of joke, right? Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Listen, I... Uh... <laughs> I'm, uh... I just wish you, uh... You wouldn't count me into this, huh? Hey, hey, Alex, all he wants to do is ask you a few questions. Yeah, Yeah. well, I just don't feel like answering any questions. Look, uh, I'm a cabbie. You want me to take you someplace, I'll take you someplace. Yeah. There's a reason you call your private life private. And if I was to talk about it with somebody I don't know, well, it just wouldn't be private anymore. So, uh, I'm sorry. Excuse me, will you? Yeah. I'll see you all tomorrow. That's our show.